Well, today is officially the day my child, Jeremiah, comes back to Gotham. Finally, I've missed him so much. This is Gotham, season five, episode four. Last episode was really good, although we ended on a bit of a cliffhanger. Haven blew up. We don't know who did it, but my guess is whoever blew up Haven was the same person who shot down the helicopter in the season premiere. The only people I could think of that did that is either Jeremiah, but he seems like the most likely suspect, so I'm gonna go with no. Bane, which is a good possibility, or someone else. I don't know who, but Jeremiah does seem the most likely option. But anyway, he's coming back tonight. I'm so, so excited. I've missed him so much. I haven't seen him since May of last year in the season four finale. And he's finally come back. And I think we're supposed to be getting Bane this episode. No, is Bane making his debut tonight? Or I think it's next week. I'm not 100% sure. I want to say he's making his debut next week. Yeah, I'm going to go with next week. But overall, I'm really excited to see Jeremiah again and to see. Hopefully, we figure out who blew up Haven, who shot on the helicopter. I don't think we'll find out tonight's episode, but I just want some answers. <laughs> Oh, fuck. Well, everyone in Haven is dead. I think, I don't know. Seems like we have some injured. Well, Penguin's okay, but no surprise there. Okay, but like, is Barbara okay? Oh yeah, she's fine, I saw her. Well, the question is, who did it? Oh, 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 oh. Babs. Now's not the time. Now's not the time, Barbara. Again, I'll be very pissed if they kill her off again this think season. I could have all those people? No. I don't know. And... No. I guess I deserve that. But I, it's not Barbara. Yeah. Jim, you read me? Yeah. We got a problem. Oh, what? On the way. What? What is it? Hey, Penguin. I would rather we put aside our considerable differences and go give the people some justice. Sounds good to me. What do you say, partner? I'm all for it. To the wild miscreants who murdered those innocent hate you have no way to run. I love you, Penguin. You're dramatic, but that's why I love you. Oh! Who was that? Show yourself, bitch. It's. Who is it? How is it? Sniper. Who is it? What if it's another guy? Oh, uh, uh. Is it Harper? <laughs> oh, Jesus. I can't see them. Don't jinx it. Probably look at a fucking RPG. Pretty cozy up here. Thanks, guys. Is that? I know the voice. That sounds like Zaz. Zaz! Oh, hey, guys. What's up? Yes! Yes! I missed him! Ooh! We just tackled him. Sorry, Zaz, but you're, you're going to jail. Absolutely Oops, no never mind. Oh, oh. <gasps> That's my child. I missed you. Now, everyone, let's reach inside and dig 
a little deeper, shall we? Because that's the only way you're all making it out of this hole. <laughs> I missed you so much. Oh. 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 Oh my god, they're fucking dancing! Just like the Joker and Harley Quinn. God, I love it. I should get this back to the lab. Doubtful that someone who could pull off such an intricate plot would forget to wear gloves. What if it's Ed? But it's all I've got to go on. Like Riddler or something, or a third personality maybe? I hope so. But I don't know. I truly hope they just I doubt it. Did this. And you make them pay. Promised. Okay, Ed, well, let's look through the file. I appreciate your help, Ed. Couldn't have done it without you. You're welcome. If you tell anyone I said that, I will deny it. <clears throat> okay, Ed, which prisoner are we looking for? Inmate number 1215, Frank McCann. Who? Frank McCann. What? Okay, so the inmate is dead. Uh oh, who's that? Hello. So we could have a we could have a potential witness. This is not justice. Not who we are. Why do I feel like the people are not going to give a fuck about what his speech? I'll consider that your closing argument. Now that the defense has rested, let's put it to the crowd. Don't do it, people. What say you, jury? Not guilty. I wish I could say I'm surprised, but this is Gotham. So wait, what are they gonna do to him? Can we just throw him in a cell? Don't kill him. <laughs> I'm trying to take this seriously, but I can't. Saz, I love you. No! Oh, Jim, I love you. <laughs> oh. Thank God. Trying to keep you all from making a terrible mistake. See, Jim Gordon cares more about protecting a murderer than he does about protecting you. You're a murderer too. I'll get the hell out of my face. Yeah, I think it was like a test to see if he would pick up the gun. See you around, Jim. And him choosing not to was him winning or passing. That's Selena. No, you stabbed him. What? I must. Oh no! It's fine. It's fine. Oh 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 oh. oh what? Am I gonna have to watch Jeremiah die like I had to watch Jerome die twice? Did they just hit Selena in the head? Jeremiah? Fuck that! Strange better bring him back somehow, wherever the fuck he is. There's no way he gets killed off just like that. 
when you had some kind of a of a rocket. I knew it was Ed. It's it's not possible. It's like a, it's the Riddler persona. You shot it at, at, at that building. Or like a third personality. I knew it was Ed. The fuck, lady? So is she lying or what? Oh uh, no, it's the Riddler. He's remembering it. It was him. It was the Riddler who did it. Uh, uh, okay, lady. Actually, you know what? Keep hitting him. That way he'll remember more. Why would Riddler do that? I mean, it's Riddler, but why? You're just gonna kill an old lady? Oh. Damn! A part of me feels like somehow they'll get back together by the end. <gasps> Ending right here, fuck that. But I'm happy. The killer of Jeremiah so he's really dead? <sighs> Bane, that was Bane. Oh. But Jeremiah has to be alive. Because of Ace Chemicals, he has to be alive for that. So it turns out it was Riddler who blew up Haven. I didn't know at first. I thought it was going to be like Jeremiah or Bane or someone else. But no, like almost halfway through the episode, there's just everything going on with Ed. A part of me was like, what if Ed secretly blew it up? Or not Ed, but like Riddler or a third personality. I didn't know that would be true. So Riddler really did blow up Haven. My child Jeremiah is dead. So I watched Jerome die twice, and now I just watched Jeremiah die. But it's not permanent, because episode 7 is Ace Chemicals. Bruce and Jeremiah are supposed to have an epic confrontation at Ace Chemicals. So my guess is Strange is going to come back and bring Jeremiah back from the dead. And then, well, here's what I think is going to happen. Uh, maybe the next episode, because I, I do know Strange is confirmed to come back. He's in the synopsis for one of the episodes. I think it's next week's episode, Strange Come Back. I think so. But Strange, when Strange comes back, obviously he's going to bring Jeremiah back. And then episode 7 is Ace Chemical. So it's already been confirmed, yes, we're getting a third character played by Kim Monaghan in the series finale. And I think it was also confirmed this third character has been secretly like watching and copying, mimicking the movements and personalities of Jerome and Jeremiah. So my guess is... I hate to say it, but Jeremiah is not the true Joker. He's just an aspect of it, like Jerome was. Jerome was at the, the, chaotic, the chaotic part. Jeremiah is like the cold, like calculating part. And the third person will be the real deal. The true and final Joker. The real fucking deal. But my guess is Jeremiah and Ace, the Ace Chemicals episode is going to fall into the vat of chemicals. And he's not going to become the Joker after doing it, but... Something is gonna be different with him after he falls in. I know a lot of people are gonna be pissed because Barbara isn't exactly like the Barbara we all know because, you know, she's crazy. Even though that's what I love about her. But a part of me always pictured Barbara and Jim getting together by the end of the show. Because if you think about it, they're supposed to have a child. Batgirl. I can honestly see that. Um... Not maybe, like, yeah, in the series finale, they're going to get together. Because we're getting a time jump, so maybe in the time jump, they'll be maybe married and they'll have a child. They definitely need to have a child. Y'all know why. As for whether that happens, I don't know. Well, that was Gotham, season 5, episode th 3. That was episode 4. Could it be episode three? Because if it's episode three, that means one less, I mean, one more week more until Gotham ends. That means we get have more time. But no, that was episode four, so we only have one, two, three, four, five, six, eight episodes to go. 
right? Because it's 12, so yeah. 8. I'm kind of glad they, they extended the season, because originally it was supposed to be 10, but they extended it to 12. I wonder what the series finale would be called, because you know, episode 9 is the trial of James Gordon. I didn't know that meant at first, but now we're getting trial, so obviously he's going to be put on trial. Oh god. What if it, what if the series finale is called Batman, or The Dark Knight, or... One Bad Day? Oh no, it can't be One Bad Day, because that was the title for one of the last episodes of season 4. Why so serious? <laughs> nah, but that'd be cool. A little reference to The Dark Knight, the movie. That'd be kind of cool, though. Well, thank you all so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Be sure to let me know what you thought of this episode and how excited you are for next week's episode on Bane. And be sure to list your theories below on who you think the main villain for the season will ultimately end up being. Will it be Jeremiah, Penguin, Bane, the Joker in the series finale? If he even is the Joker, but come on, people. It has to be. Literally. And that is it for now. I will see you guys next time.